hitting and every one of you need to know that this is the first day of the rest of your life and that means you have got to get going because those who will not work hard for their own dreams will end up working hard for someone else's dream so think about that today I know Shelly and Tom Snyder are in New Jersey they are working on their own dream that is fantastic Marianne Niehaus has just traveled the entire United States working on her dream and her little boy's dream and as we go to the cubicle or wherever we go to work every day think of whose dream you're building are you building your dream or are you building the dream of somebody else and I want you to think about your dream today because this is big time stuff we're gonna talk about going to talk about two things. I forgot what I was going to talk about yesterday that I was going to talk about today. Before I get there, I know what it was. Before I get there, don't quit on your dream. No matter what you do, don't quit on your dream. No matter what circumstance comes up, don't quit on your dream. You wouldn't tell your kids to quit on their dreams. You w and If you do, shame on you. If you look at your kid and say, what are you out there playing baseball in the driveway for? You'll never be a ma Major League Baseball player. Only 1% of all players ever end up that way. Don't tell those kids that when they're 5 and 6 years old. Let them play. Let them dream. Let them be there at Fenway Park. Let them think about hitting the ball over the green monster. Let them be that. Be your dreams, you guys. Think about when you stop dreaming. Think about when you stop having those goals. Think about when you started walking in and you're sitting at the sales meeting and that jerk walks in and starts telling you about his dream and how you're not helping with his dream. And if you don't help with his dream, you're going to get fired. And start thinking about what happens if you would get that indignant about your own dream, about your own life, about what you want out of it. I am telling you, you would have it made in the shade. You'd have it made in the shade. And each and every one of you have got that ability today. And all you need to do is know it. So today, get out of bed. It's the wedding anniversary of 27 years. It's this wonderful trip to New York City. It's these wonderful things that we get to do because we dreamt them, we made them a goal, and then we did them. And sometimes those goals, were those dreams were impossible. Little Reese's dream to play hockey, some people would have said it is impossible. His mom and Reese said, no, it's not. Tom Schneider had a dream for his wife that was literally impossible, and he accomplished it. I want you to think about your dream and what you want out of your life, and there is no reason to quit it, no circumstance to quit it. I'm going to tell you what, the second you start quitting, the second you start taking a step backwards, stuff is going to happen. I promise you, you're going to get a little tiny hole in the boat. You're going to get a huge hole in the boat. The boat may actually almost sink, but I'll tell you what, you keep paddling, you keep bailing, you keep going, and you're going to get there from here. Do not quit no matter what, and don't let any of those dream stealers steal it either. I'm telling you, you don't want to let that happen. Never let those dream stealers steal it. Those other people that say the grass is greener on the other side. Lisa Barney and I were listening to a guy talking about that a few days ago. The, grease, the grass is never greener on the other side. It just looks that way from here. You get over there, you get closer, it's worse. Stay where you are. Stay your course. Stay the coffee shop interview. Use the system that we've got. It will pay off. I promise you. And I don't care what company you came in under. It's all exactly the same thing. It's about relatedness. It's about family. It's about you taking on the goals and dreams of your four people with everything you've got. You've got to believe in them at least as much as they believe in themselves and sometimes more. And you've got to believe in yourself with everything you've got. And you've got to plug in to the person in your upline that's got that same kind of look for you in their eyes. That they believe that you can pull this off. I am so gratified to hear Diamond Executive Barbara Lucart on this call this morning. Her friend, her husband Frank, a tax man, a cool, cool family that have been with this company for a very, very long time. Those people have built their dream. They bought a brand new Lexus. She'd always want one. I wanted one. They traveled the entire United States. They had the signs on the car. It was the cutest thing. These two people going everywhere with the Shriners, everywhere they're their dream, and they own their life. Barbara was a school teacher, 
and she had this little dream and she kept just nicking away at it and all of a sudden she was able to retire as a school teacher early to go out there in the world and live her life the way she designed it that's what all of you have got in you you've got that kind of freedom in you you've got that time freedom you've got that health freedom and you've got that financial freedom and all you need to do is go get it and I'm going to promise you something there's going to be potholes in the road but I'll tell you when you're working on the potholes in the road of your dream versus the potholes in the road of Target's dream or Walmart's dream or anywhere else in a job that you suck dream that's the ones you don't want you think about the country and you think about 54 percent of the people hating their jobs everybody is finally realizing this isn't what I signed up for and you're in the driver's seat to be able to go out and give those people what they thought they were buying 20 years ago when they graduated from college the great American dream you've got it all you need to do is partner with four people jump in the foxhole with them help them get what they want and you're gonna get what you want I promise you that plug into the company plug into this call plug into the diamonds that are doing it and mark my words in longevity or anywhere else there's no entitlement this is an everyday game this is a game you play with all you've got because you've got a responsibility like no kidding responsibility to the four people that you looked in the eye and said I want you to believe in me I want you to believe in this company I want you to believe in these products I want you to believe in this comp plan and I want you to believe in yourself and if you can believe in those five things we are gonna take this thing to the moon no matter what and each and every one of you have got that in you who do you love so much that you're gonna take on the responsibility of letting them see their greatness and letting them hit their dream who do you know who do you believe in who do you want to go there with and then go have a powerful conversation with them not with your head not with a bunch of longevity or escape or ancient legacy or a prohoba brochures no don't go in there with that information go in there with your heart go in there with a look in your eye be interested not interesting and I promise you it is going to carry the day you each and every one of you have that in you and all you need to do is decide it right now there will be no failure here there will be no quit here there will be no stopping me that's what you need to decide you get that you got it I promise you I love you and Denise and I are a stand for you we will help you no matter what so call us use us that's what we're here for everybody have an unbelievable day today I love you here we come back Dun, da, da. hello 